my immigrant grandparents landed right here in New York at Ellis Island, and they made their way in American life from scratch. Raised in a middle-class family, Lou Lehrman graduated from college with honors. After teaching college for a year, Lou served in the Army and then returned to the family business begun by his grandfather. Lou and his partners built the business into Rite Aid Corporation. When Lou was president, Rite Aid grew dramatically by hundreds of stores and added thousands of new employees. Lou Lehrman is a self-made businessman whose views on economics are nationally respected. Ten years ago, he founded the Lehrman Institute to develop common-sense solutions to government problems. Along with his work for UJA Federation, Lou chaired the Cardinal Cook Dinner, which raised $1 million for parochial schools. Lou married Louise Stillman in 1966. When he walked in, it was that magical moment where you just knew that this was the right person for you. I still remember the dress she was wearing. She had pump shoes on, and she looked like the breath of spring. She drew my eye immediately. I think there's some magic in a very successful marriage. Lou does enjoy sports, and the That's children right, all enjoy course. them, and I enjoy them, so it's one thing that we really can do together. Louise gave us uh, five children. They're in terrific shape, and I'd like to see them do the most they can with uh, this ability. I believe in competition, and I teach them to play hard, and I also try to teach them to play fair. My whole mission in running for governor of New York is to make New York a better place to live. If we can get our small business community growing in New York State again, that's how we'll solve the job problem. To do that, we have to change the tax structure. Ours is a world of work and not welfare. We must build job training programs. Rules which work are simple, and they are few. Uh, I believe hard work produces wealth, not government. Uh, I believe that a dedication to providing uh, public services should begin with providing safety and security in the streets and the homes and the schools of our citizens. I believe that government should get back to basics, just like education should get back to basics. There are a lot of politicians that have had years and years to do this. They seem to have failed. My belief is that the founders of this country would be astounded at what has happened to our politics. I think we have to inaugurate, uh, in, for our generation, for the next hundred years in American life, the idea that the citizen doctor, the citizen businessman, and the citizen tradesman has a role in public life, and in fact, could do it better than a lot of the people who have been pretending to do it for the last generation. Public utilities are monopolies, and therefore they don't have the discipline of competition to clean up toxic waste right at the plant where they are created. Yes, ma'am. Uh, what are your feelings about the death penalty? I'm for the death penalty. I would appoint tougher judges to send violent criminals away to prison for a long time. And I would sign a death penalty law for cold-blooded murderers who take the lives of innocent and honest working people. We're going to inject the enthusiasm into the whole state of New York. I mean, we're going to turn the whole election into a referendum for a new future. I admire Lou Lehrman. Lou Lehrman has lots of great ideas. He speaks his own mind. Lou Lehrman will make a good governor because as a family man, he understands our problems. It's time we had a businessman as a governor. Lou Lehrman has experience creating jobs. He's done it before and he'll do it again. Lou Lehrman will make the best governor New York State ever had.